the next thing from this I can uh, let me just open it again uh, the, the, the sample that you can see here that it has five points four points in brown and one of them is in the center this is a kind of collection for example the collection of floors let me just hide these icons to see them easier and then let me open it like this and this and this one uh, you see here walls structural foundation it will give you the complete information of them like this framing again it has some other collections too like this so you know, you know mostly this icon shows that you've got a file from Revit so let me let me again open floors again here you see everyone and each one has a group and collection and here um, as you can see there is a box here that uh, if I want to just draw it into paint of windows again that you can just can see there a box like this that in front of that we have some meshings you see in front of that we have some meshes if it shows like this it means that it's a group a group that you know that the group that can include some collections or other groups and now I want to hide this item and show again the architectural file and uh, just for example consider this door here this door is group of door that if you open it it has some other groups and other collections too and actually as you can see here um, this is the whole of door so every icon here has a collection it means this is a group that it has some other collections and again we have another group that again you can see the collections here and here as you can see again we have another box again it has some meshes in front of that but it is smaller than the last one it shows an instance it is a kind of instance of a group it means that for example you have different types of doors here as I told you this icon shows that it is a kind of collection for example the collection of glass doors or this type of doors and the others please look at here this includes all of the doors so if I just click on hide unselected please look at here and again here we have a different collection for it and again another collection for that so again if I open it here every group has another collection and if I open it it is an instance that it is a kind of sample from it that again one collection from that for example is the handle or panel of that so the icon that you can see here is a kind of geometry from that icon that you saw here that you can see uh, in fact we can say it is an item from a geometry for example this handle is one item from this door or this panel is one item from this door like this you can have a category for them so let me go to mechanical structure now maybe we can just understand it better in there uh, for example just let me click on this that you can see this tool here here uh, that if you just uh, pay attention again here we have different collections here that you can see here and here again that each one is a kind of collection from this instance actually these are the icons that you have them here we have two other icons too that uh, in fact uh, it's selection icon uh, for example when I want to use this icon assume that for example I just put it let me just put it on level let me just hide it to just see it better let me show structural file and then open it just uh, to see this this item let's go on save selections just we will talk about save selections in future just let me just click it right now please take a look here you see a sample like this 
and it means you have a safe selection here. Also, you have another item in the name of search selection. Just let, let's go here. You see a find item or just, yes, let me just choose this one. Uh, let me close this one. Just I'm just giving you an example. Uh, for example, in this structure, you're just doing, let me choose one column based on a feature, for example, element. And you ask the software to find the column in this name and with this length or height. So I will just get here and then I will find a lemon here, actually based on names. And then I put on, I just put on the icon of equal. So I can copy the name here. And as you can see, it selected all of the columns. And then I will get to here and I just choose search here. And you can see a camera shape behind it. When you see the icon of camera, it means that you've done it by safe search. And if it is selection, it means that you've selected that. Actually, to save it. Um, actually, this is by searching and this is by selecting, for example. Uh, actually, the only difference that we can see between them is when you want to export the file. And this part, the export part, if you pay attention here, as you can see, we have import search sets and PDS display and search sets again. Of course, for export. It means you can't just import export search sets just. We'll talk about them later.